if we want to uh, create our new interface new uh, hal interface okay then uh, there are certain certain ways to do that and uh, first thing to note that uh, initially people were uh, when they had to define their own hal interface they were going into and the AOSP code and they were uh, uh, adding their own HAL uh, interface uh, implementations okay they defined their they implemented HAL service and they did uh, uh, all sort of things within the AOSP code that is hardware interface and inside that they were doing some changes here and there and also they uh, they were integrating into AOSP that was into Android Oreo okay initially uh, but but from Android Oreo, uh, uh, this project table got introduced, and Google had had very clearly uh, explained or um, very clearly given the instruction uh, that uh, vendor implementation and AOSP implementations will be two separate uh, parts. Okay, all the vendor implementations will go into vendor uh, partition, and uh, AOSP or Google implementation will go into uh, system partition and the uh, boot partition recovery those are separate thing but yeah uh, so um, framework component uh, will uh, AOSP framework component will go into system partition and uh, the vendor will uh, do their their stuff within the vendor partition uh, this this was part of project table and the purpose was to uh, to 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 abstract the implementation so that uh, google and vendor can do their uh, updates or implementations or whatever separately without uh, without without waiting for the other party okay so if suppose a vendor has some update they want to push to the device they can do it and same for google also if they have updated something okay uh, then uh, then device manufacturer don't don't have to wait for the vendor uh, uh, for the vendor update from the vendor they can uh, they can push uh, USP update okay Google changes update uh, only without uh, disturbing um, vendor implementation they, they don't require to recompile vendor uh, implementations basically uh, that was the case before Oreo when uh, travel was not there and when HAL was uh, intact with the US uh, system uh, partition okay so yeah, hal used to be uh, a library before but now hal is service right so there are different uh, flavor of uh, um, hal service here uh, but but again uh, few are in transition okay uh, like um, pass through that is for time being uh, but otherwise uh, binderized hal is the ultimate thing which we are supposed to implement okay and there are some other uh, there more uh, hal variant that is uh, same process hal those are special case okay uh, those are uh, special case considering the uh, nature of uh, uh, the hal uh, something like graphics and all where uh, the, the uh, through and forth is too high and uh, which is uh, not affordable to have any kind of uh, 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 bottleneck I would say or any kind of uh, glitch in between so they use same process hal okay so um, so uh, fine anyways so um, we'll, we'll uh, so here we will be writing our hal interface uh, in the vendor partition okay that's the ultimate goal over here and um, and also we are working into Android Q you can see here and USB Q uh, so ASPQ got released uh, last week okay and uh, I uh, had already compiled and executed and even I had shown one session how did I compile that okay so it was not difficult even I tried in uh, Q uh, preview version also uh, there were some uh, trouble but I could I was I was able to do that in preview version one um, so anyways so here in ASPQ we are going to do the do the um, uh, HRDL implementation okay and uh, one thing to uh, one thing to uh, tell that uh, if you're doing anything wrong okay Soong Soong is the build system right so Soong will 
uh, immediately complain so if you are not following the policies uh, uh, fixed from google okay policies enforced from the google then um, the song is going to complain that okay song is going to give error or uh, warning and something but mostly it will give error and it, it will not allow you to compile okay so those are you, you will start if you are working into android or you and directly came into android uh, queue okay and then uh, now you start porting things then probably if you have done if you had um, overlooked something about project travel then and if you try to do same thing in android queue you might get some issues okay you will start getting error from soon here and there and the reason is now our travel is more enforced okay which will not allow to um, do um, and i mean uh, take it take it easy it will not allow to uh, take it lightly okay so uh, uh, anyways so we'll be doing that okay so how to generate this uh, boilerplate um, so we have to do that first of all we need to set up uh, the environment okay so, so that we should have access to uh, usb tools right so for that we need to set like source as usual build env and then lunch 22 for um, intel 64 bit here um, so i have done this okay now i will have access to the tools now all right so what i'm going to do at this moment i will show a few of the um, few of the options which hrdl gen is is having so hrdl gen is the uh, the the tool or utility uh, to gen to 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 generate uh, boilerplate uh, implementations so it will generate uh, android.bp file as well as minimal or uh, template of uh, um, uh, template of uh, hal okay uh, hal interface based source code okay so that is it will just generate template it is not the final one right obviously so um, so what what all things we can do we can check over here hrdl have a gen help okay so this is the tool um so you can see here hrdl uses its usage is like uh, hrdl gen then you can give root path if you're not giving root path uh, it will take default something okay those are uh, mentioned here already if you go here root path then it will consider android build top as or the or the present working directory as the um, as the root path okay so we'll not provide this path this is not mandatory okay because it's in square bracket so we are going to execute everything from here so we can leave it is it is and leave it as it is we need to provide output path okay so where exactly we want to generate uh, android.pp okay there is the exception i will explain you there that later and uh, where we want to generate c plus plus or header files okay so this will tell that and what exactly we want to do that will be provided with have uh, option hyphen l okay so we will see this also hyphen o means here we can see output path all right so location of output file as i said and hyphen l is for language so this is something very important here we need to understand this very clearly um so here hyphen l tells the language so it basically tells what exactly we want to generate okay so we uh, while we are generating boilerplate or we are generating a template okay so what which template exactly we want to generate so one thing is if you are writing dot hal file right so for that that dot dot hal file we need to generate bp file so this is the option here okay android bp if you want to generate for uh, uh, if you want to generate c c plus plus so files okay so either we can do it separately if we want to have only header or if you want to have only c plus plus okay but if you want to have both then we can use directly c plus plus impl so this is the one which we are going to use okay and then um, we can have some more things here like c plus plus header source and all but we are going to use this one okay uh, or this one maybe so anyway so let's see that and then we have for 
uh, we can implement uh, HRDL interface in Java also, right? So those are the uh, interface provided, but these are internal and they're saying. So basically, um, we, we should not use this. And there are few uh, which got uh, uh, deprecated here, right? C++ is deprecated. So we should not be using it, all right? So we should not use it that. So, so this is Java VTS. Okay, so if you are uh, if you are working into VTS, um, then uh, VTS will come later on. So then VTS uh, will be generated with this language. Then likewise we can generate a make file and a hash also, uh, function count dependencies and all. So anyways, uh, so what we are going to do at the, at present, what is good enough for us to uh, to do the things okay we don't have to do all this right obviously so we will deal with only what is needed so for us we need uh, for dot hal we need this one to generate android bp okay to compile dot hal file okay and generate corresponding uh, i mean uh, um, in source okay from dot hal to dot c uh, dot cpp okay or uh, dot java all right so uh, and also um, and to generate dot so objects anyways so those android.bp file will be generated for dot health from here and uh, c++ and uh, header file will be generated with this one c++ impl and uh, and then uh, for once we generate this file right c++ uh, uh, files okay then for that we need an android.bpl file right to compile those uh, uh, source code so for that we need to uh, generate android.bp with this particular uh, language okay once everything is done now if we go to compile uh, within vendor okay vendor directory it will not allow us to do anything because if we are adding new hal right we are adding new hal right dot hal file so we need to generate hash also otherwise uh, google will i mean sorry google, uh, android google android will complain and it will not uh, allow zoom will basically not allow anything to do okay so hash is necessary okay i'll um, i'll try i will try to generate without i will try to do things without hash uh, just to showcase that what's the issue okay so if we do that hash and then we have to put the um, the changes okay whatever hash is generated into current dot txt file okay from there uh, what is the hash for particular dot hal um soon build system will pick up okay and that's how it will go okay all right so um, that's how and, and one more thing that once we have um, uh, we have our source code right and uh, dot hal files and all everything but uh, android blueprint will not pick those uh, codes so we need to have one more android.bp to uh, to include our our specific uh, hal interface okay hardware class interface to be included as part of build path so those things we will do um, so let's um let's do it in this next session thank you Thank you.